ह्यूमन बॉडी मूवमेंट टेक्स प्लेस इन थ्री प्लेन्स एंड दे आर कॉरोनल प्लेन और फ्रॉन्टल प्लेन साजिटल प्लेन और ट्रांसफर्स और हॉरिजोंटल प्लेन नाउ दीज थ्री प्लेन्स दे आर इमेजनरी दे डू नॉट एग्जिस्ट बट टू स्टडी एंड टू अंडरस्टैंड ह्यूमन बॉडी मूवमेंट इट इज इम्पॉर्टेंट टू गेट एन अंडरस्टैंडिंग अबाउट दीज थ्री प्लेन्स now consider this to be a plane okay it's imaginary now this plane it passes through my body it cuts my body exactly into half it passes through and okay from here from my right side and then from my left side so this plane exactly cutting my body into two halves front and back okay anterior and posterior exactly two halves cutting my body this imaginary plane and this is known as frontal plane or the coronal plane now if this plane it cuts my body exactly from here okay into two halves so the plane is from here and from behind cuts my body into two half left and right side then it is known as sagittal plane transverse plane is when this plane it cuts my body into two halves that is top and bottom so this is known as transverse or horizontal plane now it is uh, you know important to get um an idea about this and understand these terms because i'll be using them in upcoming um, videos when we talk about workouts and the human body movement uh now many workouts that we do in the gym many movements they are based on these planes now if i do the lat pull down okay uh the lat pull down machine so just observe my movement of the hand i hold the handle and i pull it this is how it looks i hold it and i pull it so observe this movement of the body how it's taking place and this happens in a particular plane and that is coronal plane now there are other movement also like chin ups follows the same movement okay you pull your body upward okay hold a support and pull your body up this is happening in the coronal plane there are other workouts also but i'm just mentioning a few for example sagittal plane okay movement like um seated row this is the movement taking place okay observe in which plane it is happening i said that it cuts my body into two halves left and right this is how the plane so the movement also is taking place in that particular plane so this is seated row then bent over row squats this is all happening in this particular plane transverse plane bench press observe the movement on bench press okay you are on the bench and you are pushing the barbell upward okay uh, away from your body 
see how the movement is taking place okay in which plane the plane that is cutting your body into two equal halves up and down that's the transverse plane so that's bench press then um, be, uh, um, dumbbell uh, chest press prone high rows then uh, chest fly machine okay there are a lot more to mention but it's important to understand these planes of the body because workouts are designed based on this human body movement now suppose you're doing a lot of walking activity a lot of exercises where you do regular walks um a lot of squatting movements um uh, running okay then those kind of workouts the, you're working on a particular plane okay and that is the sagittal plane you're not doing other workouts you're excluding certain workouts if you may go to the gym or you may not go to the gym but then you are not working on the other movements of the body and that is where we need to understand this that equal development of the body doesn't take place it is important to work on equal development of strength in the entire body all through the body and that is where we'll work on all the three planes a good workout plan will focus on all the three planes and that is how the design of your workout is supposed to be understood so work on your lat pull down chin ups work on the um uh, coronal plane work on the sagittal plane with all the squat movements and um, leg press lunges all of that rowing then also do transverse plane movements like chest press okay prone high rows dumbbell um uh, chest press chest fly machine if you are working only on one particular exercise doing that particular movement a lot then you are not doing equal development of your body